Hey friends, welcome to another movie talk. Today I'm gonna talk about the new Bollywood release Dishoom. It has a stunning star cast Varun Dhawan, Jacqueline Fernandez, John Ibrahim and Akshay Khanna. It's been written and directed by Rohit Dhawan who is the elder brother of Varun Dhawan. His previous movie as a director was Desi Boys whose touch we can see a little bit in Dishoom also. Dishoom is highly anticipated action adventure film. The plot of Dishoom is India's top batsman Viraj played by Saqib Salim goes missing in the Middle East and two police officers make a team for a 36 hour manhunt. John is playing the cop Kabir from India, Varun as cop Junaid from Middle East, Jacqueline Fernandez as Ishika and Akshay Khanna as Vaga, a cricket bookie. Though the story has nothing new to offer, still it's a combination of action, drama, adventure and comedy. The movie is a mix of all. However, the director is unable to conquer the hearts of the audience with his poor direction. He seems to be so busy in action-packed sequences that somehow I felt that the plot of hunting the kidnapped batsman was lost. The screenplay of the movie seems very confusing to me. Talking about performances, Varun Dhawan seems to be comfortable in comedy. However, action didn't seem to be his cup of tea. Saqib Salim was good and did justice to his role as a leading batsman of India. John Ibrahim is sizzling in his avatar and did an amazing job as a tough police officer. On the other hand, Akshay Khanna has made a marvelous comeback with this movie after four years. It was nice to see him in a negative role. The most enjoyable scene of the movie is Akshay Kumar's entry in a cameo role. He made the audience whistle with his special appearance. Jacqueline Fernandez is just okay in her role. She was able to deliver what was given in her plate. Music is by Preetam, suits to the background and the situation of the story. So, Tarake Marjlelu and Janiman Aha are already making us dance to their tunes. Impressive choreography done by Ahmed Khan. Manish Malhotra added flavor to it by his dynamic costumes. Movie is shot mostly in Abu Dhabi and India and cinematography is great. Everyone can see very clearly that shooting locations play a major role in such type of movies. Overall, Dishoom is an entertaining film, definitely one time watch. An action film is incomplete without some innovative power packed stunts and fighting scenes. And this is exactly what this film gives us. My rating to Dishoom is 2.5 out of 5. Here is Renuka signing off. I really want to know how you like my movie reviews. Please do write your comments in the comment section below. And don't forget to subscribe to our channel to get the regular movie updates. Let's meet next week with a new movie talk. Take care and God bless.